Warning, this video may contain foul language and crude sense of humor. This is meant for an adult audience. Please be advised. Hello and welcome to another edition of War Journal Toys. I am Jason. I am your vigilante on your toy hunt missions. And... Right now, I decided to throw this on so you guys get to know me a little bit. But we're starting out, we're looking at um, burial flags for my great uncle. And then that's my grandfather's. Because America, the most important thing is freedom. Everything else is tyranny. So let's get on with it. So today, I wanted to showcase why I do the call the the channel the war journal toys because I love the Punisher and I'll show you some of my collection so those are my burial flags that's obviously not Punisher as Pokemon my niece made that for me I like bats so that's cool so now we'll get into the Punisher so you got uh, I forget which which version this is. The Mighty Mugs Punisher. And then that is a dog chew toy, believe it or not. <clears throat> this one looks more like a dog chew toy. I also have a Punisher Battle Van from 1991 still mint in the box the box is pretty fantastic i'm not gonna say it's mint but it's pretty pretty legit i've never pulled it out it was never pulled out stickers never attached um sorry if the camera is a little shaky but i'm holding it with my hand so we can pan through all this In the next shelf, it's that giveaway Punisher, and then that one's a squishy Punisher. That one's also fabric, a fabric suit with a plastic head. It's got gloves on, and then you got the Mighty Mugs jigsaw bad guy. He had one gun, but I decided to give him two because he's that kind of guy. And then I got the Punisher Padlock. The Dodge Viper. The A6 Intruder. Little keychain. Lapel pin. Battle van. Ring. That's a giant pin. In the box, another car, another old school car. That one is a Punisher skull. So I'm going to go through the Punisher stuff. I do have, as you can see, Masters of the Universe. Those are my carded Mexican, Latin American versions. And then there's this. I did this with a Sharpie marker on a three foot by four foot canvas. And actually, I'm going to pause this for a minute. Okay, sorry about that, guys, but we're back. So, I'm not the greatest artist, but I can copy shit really well. So, back in the day, they had a Punisher comic book and I found two pictures I believe it's Punisher War Zone old school I think from the 90s and they had that so you can see the where I got that from but then the overall picture I used that and in art class I learned how to do a grid pattern over the whole picture and then transfer it to this 
Now mind you, it's got a flashlight on that pistol. I didn't put that on there. I, of course, didn't put the wording on, but I don't know. I think I did all right with it. I think it took me like two weeks and a fuck ton of Sharpie. But if you guys like that, put put it down in the comments. Appreciate the, the feedback. I did that and... 8903. And I know the gun's kind of a little out of proportion, but it's the way it goes. It's done. You can't fix it. So there's some more of my Masters of the Universe stuff. I've got an OG gray skull up there with some miscellaneous. And I got Eternia minis up there. I got some extra Punisher. In the package up there, freaking uh, war machine up in the corner there. I also have these. These are my packaged versions. Those up there, I'm going to eventually pull them out to go down with these this group. So I got different Punisher Hot Wheels. Sometimes they can be a pain in the ass to find. Even got this little guy, wooden, wooden toy, and then a keychain. Of course, the retro, latest one. That's an OG from the 90s. The talking thing doesn't work anymore. It used to when I bought it. And then my best friend Trent is a Moon Knight fan. So I picked those up. Those are really sweet. I've always liked Moon Knight. And then there's an old, another old school, and I actually did buy that on the peg from Kmart. So that was neat. And then I got Masters of the Universe Hot Wheels, which we're not really going over real hard. Here's some my, I do have buttons and pins, but I need to clean, clean them up before I show you that. I do have a Punisher on a motorcycle up there. I just haven't pulled them out of the package. I don't care for the head on that. And then I got Moon Knight Pops. I got some Punisher Pops. Some more Mighty Mugs. G.I. Joe, He-Man, I'm not going to spend too much time in looking at the He-Man because we're going to go through most of this, but got Jason from Friday the 13th, and then we'll quickly pan over and some of my loose guys, I'm going to do a review on some of those other items, some of them I've already done a review, and then a little bit of more He-Man. But, wanted to give you guys a, an idea of, that I do collect toys. I'm not just showing toys and doing videos. I've been collecting for a long time. This is my Punisher. Guys that are loose. I have another group up there, but I'll let you guys take a look at them. It's pretty sweet. That guy right there. Let me point at him without falling over. This guy right here is, I believe, the <clears throat> has the most weapons out of all the different Punishers. Because he has, see if I can remember, he has the rifle, he has two pistols, he's got a knife, um, I think he's got a club. Might have two knives, but yeah, he's definitely well armed. And then you got this shelf. I know there's a Red Skull keychain there, but I like collecting Red Skull stuff too. Just because he's the Captain America's adversary. 
you can't be a hero if you don't have an abs adversary. So, there's Crossbones, who killed Captain America. But, I just wanted to do this quick video. It's I know it's ten minutes already into it. Oh, and this, I also have him, who he's really cool, the new one, and then I got an OG, but, so, let me know what you guys think in the comment section, um, I have comic books, I have clothing, I have a bunch of other stuff, I have an original, and I have an original movie, VHS movie poster from The Punisher, uh, 1989 uh, so as as time will go I will show you guys more of my stuff and always remember God bless America and thank you to our veterans get this off and if you guys enjoy my content please like share subscribe you know the the routine and I'll catch you on the next time